Good morning from sunny Preston. It's uh, Mother's Day here in England today. Uh, mind you, I think it's Mother's Day everywhere in the world, isn't it? I don't know. Uh, but I thought I'd show you today my aces that I planted out in the garden. This is the the bottom end that gets a lot of sun. So these are my ground planted aces. Uh, just trying to thicken them up really. I didn't pay a lot of money for them, so they're not very big. But I love the colours. I mean, this little one here, I actually thought this had died, but it's coming out nicely. Look at those greens, absolute gorgeous. And this is an orange dream. Gorgeous tree. Apparently doesn't like the wind. It can get a lot of wind burn, but it doesn't get too windy down this end of the garden. And this is a Katsura. Now I splashed out the big money on this baby. I think I paid £24 for it. Um, but one of the reasons was it had quite a large, it was a lot bigger, but I did an air layer here last late summer. I only planted them in the spring, but in late summer I did an air layer. It was very successful. It took it only six weeks, and this is what I got out of it. It's growing nicely. I grew, I grew, um, I did the air layer at a junction to give me options. Um, I'm just gonna let that grow in its pot for a bit. So there's other orange dreams because I just love the orange dreams. I love those colours. They're stunning in the sun. This is a going green. And I love these going greens. Green stems look great in the winter, but look at that vivid foliage. And this is an Ace of Palmate and Blood Gold. Deep maroon colour. But what was good about this was, when I planted it, it had like, an amazing fully radial root system. So I actually planted that on a tile, spread the roots out radially, and let that grow. So when I dig that up in a couple, two or three years, that's going to have, hopefully, an amazing nabari. So I'm looking forward to that. And this is an Ace of Butterfly. Um, I don't really like these for bonsai, if I'm honest. I bought these from B&M Bargains. Most of them were only £4. Um, so there's no harm done. And they're just nice plants to have, even if I don't end up doing them as bonsai. I'll, uh, I'll just enjoy them. And I'll just show you this one last tree here. I've just planted this this morning. I didn't show, I didn't video myself doing it because it's pretty boring. But this is a, a little princess. It actually came with this. This was the other half of it here. And it was one of those where there's two, there's kind of two trees in one pot, which is why I picked it out. I separated them, planted that one in there. And this one I just put in the ground um, just to let it develop. It's pretty spindly and thin. It'll need a few years to develop. I put a bit of wire on it with a very loose coil just to kind of spread those, spread the branches out a bit. And uh, that's also been, it had a nice flat root system. So again, that's been planted on a little piece of stone, a little uh, sort of circle of, uh, I don't know what it was like cement or something but it's flat and it'll help the nabari develop so apparently they're good for bonsai the little princess so i've got hopes for those and i just thought i'd show you really my aces and what they're doing in the gorgeous sunlight I and mean, what what's not to like you can grow these even if you're not into bonsai you'd be mad not to have some of these in the garden i think anyway have a great mother's mothering sunday and uh I'll catch you soon.